guys, and welcome to my channel. My name is Brenda, and if you love home decor, then you're in the right place. If you're an oldie but a goodie, welcome back. Today, I'm bringing you guys a huge home goods haul plus some really amazing restoration hardware dupes. So keep on watching. Still, it feels like I pretend. Keep on driving and driving along the roads and never end. As my head of your mind's back between the jars and bottle jugs, just me and all the red lights. Keep on driving and driving. All right, so before. Before we begin, I wanted to give you guys a huge thank you and a happy New Year's. I cannot believe it is officially 2021. Wow, like this year, this past year has been one hell of a year for a lot of us. But you know what, guys? We made it through. We're here. I'm hoping for nothing but the best. And I just cannot wait to see what 2021 has in stores. Even though 2020 was a hard year for a lot of us, there was a lot of positivity that came out of it as well. And one of it was you guys. I really want to just give you guys a huge thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for supporting me in every way possible whether it's here or instagram or tiktok or just any platform that i have and if you follow me on every single one thank you it really means the world to me you guys have no idea how hard i work on every single video that i put out for you guys and the fact that we started this channel eight months ago and i was just on and off a lot to be completely honest with you guys and i didn't choose to be consistent until a few months ago maybe five almost six months ago now and from there to now my youtube family has grown over six thousand subscribers i just it makes me so happy i always share with you guys every little milestone that i hit on my youtube channel because i truly enjoy what i do i truly love inspiring so many of you guys i love when you all tag me and you just you know you share with me at home it is such an amazing feeling that i just wouldn't have it any other way. Again, a million times, thank you. And I hope you guys continue to support me and my journey here on YouTube for the remainder of the year for 2021. And I cannot wait to see us grow. I cannot wait to see, you know, where my journey here goes. And I just, I appreciate each and every one of you guys sending you each a virtual hug. And yeah, I hope you guys had an amazing time with your friends and family for New Year's. Now, let's go ahead and jump right into today's video. So you guys know, that Home Goods is one of my favorite places to go shopping for home decor, and it is also one of the best places to find restoration hardware dupes. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys some of the pieces that I saw and may or may not have brought home with me, so let's jump right in. Hey guys, so I'm going to Home Goods. It's raining, so I'm like rushing in, but let's go see what we find. This little guy is giving me such restoration hardware vibes, but kind of creepy so I'm not gonna take it but I do like the texture and the color of him wow look at this beauty oh my goodness resto vibes wow and it's only $39.99 I don't think I'm gonna pick it up for myself but if you love this make your way to home goods it is a stunning piece to have Look at these vases, you guys. Wow, the texture is so beautiful. I cannot. Let's see how much these are. So this one is $25. This guy right here. And then these, oh, $25. So they're both $25. Wow, they are stunning. Absolutely stunning if you guys want vases with texture. You have to try to find these at your local home goods. Okay, so you guys saw that I actually saw a lot of really good pieces. Even though I chose not to bring them home with me, doesn't mean that they're a great addition for your home. If you guys love any of those pieces and you see them, I highly recommend you bring them home. You guys know that I love me a very modern, minimal home. I just feel like that's more of my vibe and it's very restoration hardware inspired. So if you're like me and you really want to achieve that look, then definitely make your way to home goods. And I'm also I'm actually gonna go ahead and show you guys some of the pieces that I did bring home with me. So let me go ahead and show you guys the first one. It is this amazing vessel right here. How cute is she? Okay, so if you guys caught my last video, it was a Target haul. A lot of the pieces were from Project 62. I wanted to add a lot more texture to my home in a very almost minimal and muted way. I don't want it to be so like 
out there because again, I'm not a very color crazy type of person. Even when it comes to my home decor, I like a very black and white aesthetic with earthy tones. It's not so orangey, it's just perfect. And I only got her for $12.99, 12 bucks. Keep an eye out there is amazing vessels that you can find on home goods, especially right now. My last trip, I found so many. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, go follow me on Instagram because on Instagram, I share a lot of the things that I do see at the stores that I may not bring home with me. So make sure you guys go follow me on Instagram. Check out my stories. I posted some other really beautiful ones, but I chose not to bring them with home to, with me because I have so many vessels already. I have to kind of, you know, invest my time into other pieces but they're stunning. I highly recommend you guys go to HomeGoods and check out their vessels. Next up, I did mention that I wanna make some changes to my bedroom. Again, going back to the adding of gold, I noticed this last trip that I went to Restoration Hardware that they use a lot more gold than what I have. So I thought to myself, I'm going to start investing in really good pieces that, are, that bring that gold aesthetic to my home, but not too much, okay? Because I, I've said it before, when you add too much gold, it starts to look tacky. So you have to make sure you're very careful with gold. And one of the things that I found, and one of the things that I'm adding to my bedroom, you guys know that I have nightstands, is these lamps right here. Ah, how amazing are these? Oh my gosh. I have been on the hunt for the perfect lamps for my nightstands. I cannot bring myself to purchase any of them until I saw these and I just, I literally started hunting for the second one. I was like, no, these are it, these are it. Look how chic and modern these are. I absolutely love them. When I brought them home and I put them on my nightstands, oh my God, it just added that pop of gold that I wanted just right. I actually ended up removing my chandelier from my bedroom because I wanted to put these guys in it and I just, oh, I'm so happy. And the best part is you guys, you can plug in your phone at night. Where is it? Here it is. You can plug in your phone, it has a USB on it. So that is amazing, that's a plus. And I absolutely love these, like I said, they're $39.99. I picked up two of them, one for each one of my nightstands. And these again are very resto vibes. At least to me they are. I feel like Restoration Hardware does a lot of the very sleek and modern like pieces and this is a great dupe. I just am so happy with these. Like I said guys, I was on the hunt for the perfect lamps for my nightstand and these, were the winners. So I picked up two of these. I recommend you guys pick them up for your bedroom. I promise you, you will love them. At night, it is such a vibe in the room. Like the colors, the lamps, it's just, oh, it's such a vibe in my room at night. So I absolutely recommend these. Like I said, it gives it that very sleek and modern look. So it's a plus. Next up, moss. Okay, you guys know that Restoration Hardware does a lot of moss, okay? You can find great moss at Home Goods for only five bucks. Five bucks. It was time for me to get rid of my old moss and buy some new ones. So these right here, I'm actually going to be placing in a bowl. One of my biggest tips when you're buying moss, this is just my personal preference, is I recommend you go with the darker moss. If you pay attention to Restoration Hardware, they use a very dark moss that almost looks real. And this right here, it has the same look. It actually even says softer and longer lasting. So that's a plus. I like that it looks very real, like real moss. Like I said, I highly recommend you pick that kind up instead. They have the lighter moss, which I personally don't like. I think it looks cheap. As to this one, it looks so much more real. And the tip that I got from one of my friends is that if you guys water your moss, it makes it look even more real. <laughs> so I've been doing that ever since I saw that on her story. So make sure you guys spread some water on it and it looks amazing. I absolutely love it. I'm thinking of putting that moss in a big, large white bowl or even like this bowl that I have right here on my dining table. I'm actually sitting on my dining table. Do you guys notice? Here's my setup. Right here, it's my background. <laughs> I thought I'd film somewhere different, so I hope you guys like it. But um, yeah, so I'm thinking of putting moss in this bowl right here, which is on my dining table. That's another tip. Go to Home Goods and pick yourself up some moss. It is a huge resto dupe. They use moss for everything. Next up, another dupe that I've got. I picked up a few of these from Home Goods, and you will see driftwood at Restoration Hardware stores. They use it a lot for their coffee tables. They use it for media consoles. They use it for entryway tables. So I picked up another driftwood for me. I actually have the exact same one already, but I wanted another one because I wanted to incorporate one on my coffee table. So the one that I have is already on my media console, and I wanted to put this guy on my coffee table. And then I have another one in my son's bedroom. Bedroom, and then I have another one in my bedroom. 
so I picked up one more of these. Like I said, I wanted to just have driftwood everywhere. I feel like driftwood really brings in that earthy element to your home, and I absolutely love that. I love bringing in the earthy tones to my home. I love the texture. I love the look. I love the lightness of the driftwood. I'm not sure if you can find darker ones. I've always you know, tend to gravitate towards the lighter ones. But I recommend that if you're really going for that restoration hardware look, you pick yourself up some driftwood. I promise you guys, placing it next to your Tom Ford coffee table book, resto vibes, super restoration hardware vibes. Last but certainly not least, one of the biggest things that I've raved about that I personally like to look, keep my eye out, keep, you know, on the lookout whenever I go to Home Goods is coffee table books. You guys can find coffee table books at Home Goods almost in every location that you go to. Make your way to the home decor section, look where they have those coffee table books, and keep an eye out. I saved the best for last. This guy right here, I cannot believe when I found him. Like, I was in shock. This beauty was hidden in the back of that shelf. Oh my goodness, I literally died. I died and came back to life at home, guys. I cannot believe that I found this coffee table book. I haven't even opened it because I wanted to open it here with you guys. So this book was actually $69.99. You guys can see right here. I haven't even opened it. I've been saving it to really just show it to you guys the way that it comes packaged and all. And I'm just so, ugh, I'm just, I can't even express how happy I am that I have found this book at Home Goods because, like I said, keep your eye out. I've seen people find the Louis Vuitton coffee table book. I've seen people find the Architectural Digest book at Home Goods. So the fact that I found this guy at Home Goods for only $69.99, okay, you guys, it retails for $100. I scored big time. But now that I have you guys on camera here with me, let's go ahead and open it. So this is the Dior New Looks. Oh my God. Up close. Oh my God. Oh my God. I could not have found a much more better book. Like I, and I don't even have this one, you guys. I don't have this beauty. Oh my God. I love it. I love it so much. You guys have no idea. So let's go ahead and take the book out. So here she is. If you guys see this book, at your home goods, pick it up, okay? Pick it up. It is so stunning, so beautiful. Let me go ahead and show you guys the pictures inside. Oh, oh my God. I actually haven't even looked through it. Oh my God. Oh my God, so stunning. The photography is just so beautiful. So here it is. Like I said, you guys can see it. It is actually the same material as my Architectural Digest book. So I'm gonna be very, very, very careful with it. I actually don't think I'm gonna be taking it out of the box because I don't want it to get dirty. It is a really light color and I absolutely love the cover of the box anyways. Like I almost wish it would have had it on the book, this exact look right here. So it's okay. No worries, but do you guys see how you can find really good finds at home goods? You just have to make sure that you keep an eye out. And another thing, Restoration Hardware uses a ton of coffee table books in their home decor. So even if it's a coffee table book alone on like a little nightstand or a side table for your couch, you have to have good coffee table books. And I have a ton of them, a ton of my favorite ones linked on my Amazon storefront, so make sure you guys go check out my Amazon storefront if you guys wanna find some really good coffee table books. But, home goods, home goods, you guys, go to home goods. All right, and that completes today's video. I feel like I'm a news anchor, you guys, because I'm, never, I'm not used to having a table in front of me. So you guys probably already saw me like move my arms so much, but um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Oh, wait, 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 one more thing. Do you guys see that right there? Huge. Restoration Hardware dupe. Restoration Hardware uses a ton of crystals. And let me tell you guys, I saw so many good crystals at Home Goods this last trip when I picked up all these items. So keep your eye out at Home Goods. This guy right here, I actually did get it from Home Goods a while ago, and it was one of my best finds. I remember when I got it, and it was for very cheap, and I always keep my eye out for really big crystals. You guys, I have so many amazing videos planned out for this new year. I cannot wait to share it with you guys. Come along my journey, hit that like button, hit the notification bell button, 
please make sure you guys give this video a huge thumbs up it truly does help me out and like I said you guys are part of my journey now so everything that I do I love sharing it with you guys and I love when you guys you know comment down below and you guys chat it up with me I absolutely love that let me know down below what changes you are going to be making to your home this year I would love to know are you going to be adding new pieces are you going to be going more for a different vibe a different look let me know down below what is your home decor plans for 2021 make sure you guys stay safe i'll catch you all on my next video bye